And I'm proud to be a millennial <laughs> with my side party and skin jeans. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> listen, 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 listen. You said, why would we make a monument to death? It's too sad. You know what I say? What do you call every monument? <gasps> they usually are all dead. Usually. Yeah. Or, you know, it goes deeper. So, I guess, <laughs> but fine, we'll appease you. We'll do something fun. We'll do something childish and nostalgic for you know, certain groups of people that are our age or older. Or by like, our age or older. <laughs> our age or older by like maybe 20 years, Tops. probably 20, maybe 30. 30. Tops. 30, yeah. That age demographic that really no, liked our I mean, our 60-year-olds so. fucking with this shit? Oh, yeah, I guess we're... Oh, I, I, I'm i thinking, like, 55-year-old. I forgot I'm almost 30 now, too. Yeah. Whoops. Yep. I mean, pinball. I would, I would pinball. go as far as 20. No, like, 30... 60-year-olds are playing pinball. Oh, shit. 60-year-olds all playing pinball. pinball. We're talking We're talking arcade oh, cabinets. Shit. Pinball's not on the fucking... No, Dude, 30 no years allowed. ago... 30 years ago was uh the 80s. No, that was... 91 was exactly 30 yeah. years ago. Ouch. Yeah. I'm 30. <laughs> More than That's 30 when years I was ago. born. Yeah. 40 years ago was the 80s. Yeah. Uh -huh. So, like, I mean, 40 yeah, years, people yeah, are 40, 45 and under. People, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So, so yeah, yeah. First off, we're, doing, talking, we're doing arcade cabinets. Yeah, I said that. Uh, I said that. Yeah, you did. But I, I just wanted to yeah, clarify. Is pinball? No. No. Pinball's no pinball. off the table. No, okay. we're talking All right, cool, cool. Cabinets, games with screen, video games, like yeah. video screens. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Buttons, yeah. no flippers. Gotcha. Because, no like, balls. pinball should be its own fucking thing. Yeah. yeah. Pinball, yeah, yeah, that's a whole separate category that exists in the same ecosystem. Some tables suck. Some are awesome. Yep. I would also say, yeah, the, 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 Pinball is a yeah separate species in the same ecosystem. I'd be so hyped for that one, but yeah. uh, we'll throw it on the list, bro. Yeah, it's true. We got uh, I mean, yeah, I would feel like pool tables and foosball are also another species in that same ecosystem. Foosball, foosball. yeah. How many kinds of foosball are there? Yeah, I mean, foosball, fuck? table hawk, or like uh, bubble oh, hockey. Oh, 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 other, oh, other weird okay. stick-based sports. Okay. Yeah, stick. <laughs> stick based versions sounds, of sports that sounds like baseball i don't know i mean yeah, there's like a bubble baseball that something like that too right uh, yeah, well yeah, there's like a little like bat that you swing yeah there's like a foos there's baseball like there's like a foos basketball i'm pretty sure i've seen yeah, okay. where you yeah just that's that's what i'm saying ball. all i mean normally the the, the well, granddaddy of it all is soccer okay, we're, right, we, 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 gotta, we gotta yeah. start getting into the shit yeah we, yeah we need to roll our dice but i need to pull up the app first because oh, i'm shit. dumb and forgot about that all right we gotta roll a d20 to figure out who goes first a motherfucking d20 roll my dice oh you son of a bitch <gasps> 19 <laughs> baby no. 15 Three. Fifty's going first. You suck, Scott. That's like three weeks in a row you've gotten last. last. But I mean, last gets two picks in a row. Yeah, I'm not afraid of but being But you don't last. get one of the initial picks, so the good shit gets gone. All right, so I am going in true Rushmore fashion. I'm going to do my first love, change the game, wild card, and favorite. So first love for arcade cabinets specifically. I'm going with Dr. Mario. What? I know. I know. That's the doc? Yeah. It's a good game, but you that would, is a Game Boy game for you me. You would think that I'd be going with something like Tetris. Whoa! Don't be taking However, pics now, buddy. I'm going with Dr. Mario. I enjoy playing Tetris on, like, Whoa! a console. It's similar. Or, like, I on the PC. I but I hate playing it on a cabinet for some reason. Can we reason. at least call it a Russian blocknik game? Oh, you still know what I'm talking about. Stop dropping pics, bro. <laughs> To, yeah, I'm going with Dr. Mario. That's like respectable. That's credit. the first arcade cabinet that I was like, I, I, I enjoy this much more on an arcade cabinet. Banger soundtrack. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that shit rocks. So <laughs> that's yeah. a good pick. Oh, it's man. a weird pick. That's a, no, yeah. it's a respectable pick. I feel like yeah. all mine are pretty weird picks. Pretty okay, safe. man. So well, except my, my next one, but... All right, so Jake, your second. You, I was really hoping you were gonna take one of my picks to help me narrow it down a bit because I have three that really stand out that fit the George Washington template for myself. Okay, there's three. Your first love? Four, really? Oh fuck. Um, I got it. I think I'm gonna have to go with the big boy. No, you better not. Physically, the big no, boy. No, you better oh, no. fucking not. That was gonna be my first pick. Oh, X Men. No. Fuck you. Oh, thank fuck. It's. Uh, it, uh, I got. I'll tell you later what my other top hot ones were okay. for there. But man, 
Why you, you don't even know why you should pick X Men? Because it's a two screen game. Yeah, and it's there's six players. Super fucking weird how they like have a screen facing up with a mirror to make line up with a, another CRT. That shit is some crazy science. Yeah, actually, yeah, it's like I really magic, liked but. it. I uh, that when I would go to the arcade that you was near my house when I was a child, I that was one of my go tos. That was one of my like. It must plays every every time. It's one of the I'd only be, games that everyone can fucking play. Yeah, it's great. I mean, who's I always your, had a lot of friends. Like all right, this, who's your favorite character to play? Nightcrawler, as? duh. Fuck yeah, me Obviously. too. Obviously. What do you? What do you? Who do you? Who's the sixth player? Dazzler. Yeah. Fuck you. Fuck you. No, I I usually try to go for Wolverine. That's, yeah, that's see? that's the other good choice. Yeah. Colossus would have also been accepted. Storm, Storm can be pretty sick. Kind Storm of. actually can be pretty sick. Yeah. I honestly have been to arcades where the Dazzler stick's broken, and I just think they don't care. They're they like, don't. that's probably for the best. Because they know that like, no one wants to play fucking Dazzler. Dazzler sucks. Sucks. All right. Well, I'll pass the turn to you. Uh. Okay. All right. Okay. George Washington. Uh huh. I want to pick. Here's the thing that's going to surprise you. I don't think there's nearly enough classic games on my list. Yeah, I'm not taking that's the, not surprising, the fucking actually. bangers. Uh, I want to take this game for the way one, it's it's cool, and two, the way it made me feel as a child, which was scared. I was like too scared to play House of the Dead. Ah, fuck! 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 <laughs> fuck! 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 Uh, yeah. God. Gun games are it. cool as shit. That one was the first one that I was like, I would I would stand 15 feet away in the arcade and watch the screen and be like, my maybe, favorite maybe, tip. Maybe today I, I can play the, that. I game. love walking past that at work, and when people are playing, I'm like, and they're fighting the shoot, the the bat guy. Yeah. I'm like, hey, pro tip: shoot him in the dick. Yeah, it's one of his weak areas. Yep, they don't really signify, but you can shoot him in the dick a I like, lot. You can shoot like everyone in the dick. In yeah, the and it's yeah, it's great. Good, good. Are you that? Oh <laughs> damn! Yeah, that fucks up my whole list. <laughs> That's a whole franchise too. Gone. Yeah, yeah. yeah of you course. can't pick House of the Dead two like some scrub. Right. I mean, there's plenty of other gun games, Brad. None of them are nearly as good. <laughs> uh, there's one. There's, there's one, one, one that I would say is equally as good. But. House of the Dead made me like terrified. Like Dude, I stood far Dead. away, and it had the darkness that was around the, it. That was, it was one the of the corner. ones. That was one of the ones that was, it was tied for first yep. for me. Yep. So I, yeah. Oh, I go back to back. You, you got. You got a minute. You got a minute. Fudge uh, me in the fudge okay. hole. Okay. Fudge hole. <laughs> so there's like you know the other obvious choice, and the third obvious choice. But we're going change the game. Yeah. All right. Fuck. Okay. Yeah. 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 Change the game. My Jeffy. I thought I was going to have this later, but mm-hmm. I'm going to put it up there now. I'm taking Big Buck Hunter HD. Oh, <laughs> shit, that's a good one. <laughs> not not sp- like specifically HD, because that's when they added online like Wi-Fi, uh-huh. and then you can put in your fucking digits and save a profile and unlock achievements anywhere oh, in the world. Oh, that's pretty dope. I'm addicted to getting my fucking Buck Hunter achievements up. Yeah. And then, you yeah, know. Buck Hunter no. is, yeah. The, I didn't know. One, it's I everywhere. Is, is it, next time we, you're, we're together in a location with one of these you gotta you gotta let me know yeah it's I, sick i'm gonna sign up for that shit that sounds so, awesome so far yeah. you have two rail shooters on your list yeah, yeah, rail yeah, shooters yeah. are fucking sick yeah. rail shooters are fucking sick but yeah. buck hunter is different because you know house of the dead is is a completely different thing buck hunter i feel like i'm in control and i'm like it's almost like a puzzle yeah like yeah, your yeah, first yeah. shot feel, sets like, the tone i yeah. get the same satisfaction out of like a hunting arcade game or a hunting game period if it has the gun peripheral I do with like a golf game. I yeah. don't know why. See, huh. I really okay. almost put Golden Tee on my list instead of this Ooh. for the same theory that like it is everywhere. And I don't. It's super fucking good. <laughs> See, he said golf game. We all yeah, think yeah, it. Yeah, I yeah, mean, yeah. I'm not even talking. I I don't like like a Golden Tee type of golf game. I do. I mean, I guess maybe I just haven't played them enough because yeah. every time we're somewhere like a bar that has one, it's always league night somehow. Yeah, <laughs> it's always That's league. A really good point. <laughs> it's always league <laughs> night. That is true. <laughs> I really like, honestly, the Irish local shit. Yeah, playing outside with the cigars and stuff. I yeah. bet, dude. That's good time. one of the reasons. That's one of my favorite bars is because you can get cigars and smoke them on the patio, and I feel fancy. I feel and play fancy. golden tea. Yeah. Makes me feel fancy smoking a, gar- a cigar at a bar. If you're gonna spend the next three hours with this one cigar, you gotta play some golden tea. Yeah, it's yeah, awesome. Uh, <laughs> I'm talking more like like a like a three button golf game. It gives me oh. the same. I don't know why. I don't like the, those synapses are connecting in my brain right now for some reason. Probably because I've been playing a lot of those sure, golf games. Right. Right. recently 
dude, I'm getting good at uh, everybody's <laughs> golf. Yeah, I did turn on. I will admit, I did turn on tornado cups because putting is still nearly impossible. Oh, okay. But so is your second pick every or golden tee? No. <laughs> What's your is second? It my pick? second pick? No, yeah. wait. Doesn't it go to you? Oh no, you were first. Yeah, yeah. so it does go back. My yeah. second pick was going to be House of the Dead. So was mine. <laughs> Motherfucker. Number one, baby. Um, so. Definitely changed the game. I got to think a little bit. Oh, just a smidge, smidge, smidge. There's only one that's really sticking out in my head. Mm -hmm. Now, this one did change the game for me. I was not introduced to it in an arcade, but it was. I was introduced Ooh, to it on a one of those plug-and-play arcade. Oh. Maybe little, I don't know what it is. joystick game thingies that you used to hook up to CRT TVs. Mm-hmm. And then I did find it in an arcade and realized, oh yeah, this is this is the way to play this game. And that game is Galaga. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Classic. Okay. Yeah. Classic. Classic. Yeah. Uh, I still love it. Like, I still feel really cool when I get the second shit. Yeah. yeah you know, yeah, yeah. like that's like it's not it's, difficult, but it's not easy. Either. Yeah, and it's like it I is, struggle with that. It's so powerful when you have the two. Yeah. yeah. Especially when you get to that first bonus stage and you're just clearing them before they even get to the screen. So good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Getting, oh man, it's just so satisfying. It's just, it is a very, one of the, it is a classic because it is probably one of the most satisfying arcade games there is. I think it's also one of the ones that you feel good at, even when you're not. Like, yeah, getting to like, level 10 isn't extremely difficult. Play four or five games and you can probably get through the first few, like, yeah, waves. Yeah, people always feel, feel like good. they're good at that game. Like, that probably is the single mo like game that people say, oh, I got the high score on Galaga. Right, yeah. Because, like, you can always pass the high score that's, like, pre-programmed on I also it. didn't realize until I started working at Up Down that that's a game that you can actually just play a six-hour game on. Yep. Yeah. Goes forever. Jesus. Goes forever. Actually, I do think there is a a, a kill screen. Uh, yeah, eventually you run out of data. But yeah. Maybe, okay. Or maybe just loops. I think it just loops the final level forever. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Anyway. You can max out the score. Yeah. I figured that would get picked. Somebody had to take Gallagher. Yeah. Yeah. Not All upset. right, Bradley. All right. Number so, two. The one that changed the game for me, uh, I guess, after House of the Dead, uh, the one that I really got like hooked on that like kind of came out of nowhere that I just, I remember sinking token after token into uh, for just months on end. Fucking cruising, yeah, yeah, <laughs> cruising <laughs> USA or cruising about, world. Didn't even think about driving games. I didn't think about it. I, I mean, pretty I, fucking fun. Like I, I enjoyed, I enjoyed Crazy Taxi, but cruising, <sighs> yeah. really fucking got me well, in. It's the multiplayer aspect. I wanna. That, I guess you only played one, one by itself too. Holy shit. I, yeah, I, I mean, it was. I'm literally just trying to like beat the time of the person before me. Yeah, yeah, dude. I, God, I haven't played cruising in a while. I don't either. That Racing games sick. are great. Um, no, I just want to sit and sink an hour or two into cruising. Yeah, yeah. I don't <laughs> think it's gonna be picked, but there's. There, I wish there was more like multiplayer arcade games where like you're the two people are doing different things, like like Lucky and Wild. Oh yeah, that game's fucking awesome. Oh, I don't think that one's gonna yeah. get picked. But, so I, I don't think it's bad. That, that is pretty have. dope. I should. Yeah, like one's driving, one's shooting. Yeah, and well, I guess one's driving help. and shooting, Fuck. and then the other one's just shooting. But you got like I think there's a button that you get to do stuff with. Oh yeah, no, I gotta say my wild card, baby. Wildest of cards. All right, I'm very happy about my wild card pick. This is one that seemed like it came out of fucking left field. Uh, and it like it it plays so simple. However, it's it's also very new, and it's just one button. Talking about switch and shoot, you damn it. motherfucker! <laughs> Are you kidding me? Was that on, was that your wild card? <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> Whoa, fuck! I didn't think anyone was gonna pick switch and shoot. Yeah, yeah, I had this shoot. whole I had a whole social media campaign involved in my head with that pick. <laughs> I was very dedicated to getting you, son of a bitch. Oh, man. Oh, I'm sorry. You that's, the, hey, that's the way the uh, dice roll, baby. I think there's literally two in existence. Yeah. yeah. That's it. No, he's made a lot. Oh, okay. Oh, good, you can good. buy them. He, someone uh, that worked with the Up Down in Minneapolis has one bought in their one. house. Yeah. Okay, well, yeah, I'm sure right, there's so, some. So for, for the ones. uninitiated, for those who ain't been ones. new, for those that are out out of towners that uh, don't know what switch and shoot is, it's a single button arcade game that plays like Galaga. Know, yeah, but pretty similar to Galaga. Yeah, um, it's, yeah, it's, yeah. And clear, it's all very you do inspired. is you, you you hit the button, you it makes you switch directions, and you also shoot. Yep, up. switch and shoot. Yeah. You get uh, you get the uh, power ups, and your shoots get better. It's addicting. Yeah. 
Oh, it's so addictive. Uh, I own that game on Nintendo Switch and my computer. I also love that it gives you a cons a consolidation credit. If yeah, you if you suck, suck too bad. so bad, they're like, yeah. go again. Yeah. You, you, go again. You try it again. Yeah, you'll get the hang it's, of it eventually. Uh, <laughs> the guy uh, Des Moines Arcade give give a shout out to Des Moines Arcade. They're uh, or DSM Arcade yeah, specifically. DSM Arcade. It's uh, he's a, he's a cool guy. He yeah. makes he makes the cabinets and uh, <laughs> I don't remember the guy who made the game, but he's also a cool guy. I've talked to him on Twitter. I've talked to both of them on Twitter, but they're it's pretty cool. Uh, so now you got to come up with a new wild yeah, card. Yeah, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Don't you go back to back. I just did. Oh, that was your last one. Yeah. No, that was my wild card. You That's innovative it. as fuck. Why did it I not pick that? Yeah. Why did I not put it on my list? This is another game that our our group definitely went a, through a fad where we all played this oh, game. Shit. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> just like Switch and Shoot. <laughs> And I, I, I really forgot about this game until I was in the at the Minneapolis up down and I saw it and I was uh-huh, like, uh huh, uh huh. Oh, bitch, I'm getting that. I'm getting in there. God, I'm I can't believe that. how quickly we both I, realized what yeah. he's talking about. I just want to lift some balls into some holes, baby. I want to play ice cold beer. Dude, ice cold beer is so good. So good. So I didn't put that on my list as soon as you said games with screens. Fair, but I mean, but that's a wild but it, card. It, but it plays it's an like an arcade cabinet. cabinet. Yeah. It, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's I'm, not. Also, yeah. when we did King of the Cade, Ice Cold Beer oh, was absolutely. one of the games. Fuck yeah, that's the most skill based thing in there. Yeah. God, that game's fun as oh, fuck. Man, I, I, I still play, have people ask me about it. I played it a couple rounds at the Minneapolis one. I feel like their customers take way better care of their games. Yeah, there. theirs works way better than ours. Well, no, I mean, just like I don't know. There was a couple that were out of order but they were like the ones where i was like okay I, yeah those ones just yeah. go out of order like x-men sure you know, if that one's out of order like something's actually wrong with it but like i didn't see like you know like the plexiglass on top of the over that goes over like the artwork none of them were like gross that's nice <laughs> uh did you none of them have no, i didn't hear people punching the games oh god you're having to look at their killer queen they didn't have it. What? what? Wasn't there? <gasps> Maybe because it's too close together. Oh when you my play. god! Their killer queen. Uh, people play it so hard that like the friction from their hands have rubbed off all the art just around every button. Oh, that's amazing! And you can literally see like this is where his palm goes, and then this is where his fingers that's are. What, uh, and it's getting, off. Ours is getting like that. Yeah, theirs was like bald. Like, yeah. It was crazy. Like, yeah, so they groups. just have like leagues yeah. every oh, yeah, night. Like, <laughs> yeah, no, they didn't oh. have it. It was I was surprised. Maybe it, 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 I mean it could have been a. Well, no, I don't know. I think well, it's because literally you have to be inches from each other yeah. playing it. They're yeah. like, nah, thanks. Yeah, that's uh, a good point. Uh, who's but up next? I mean, if you're playing you're it with like down. nine other people, you probably all know each other. Ah, actually, not no, that's not at always all. true. Not at all. Most of the time, I'm playing that game with at least one stranger. Uh, it's mm-hmm. always everybody. I, yeah. I don't know. All right. Um, my wild card. Yeah, what's your wild card, baby? Uh, it's a wild card specifically for me, and I think maybe a few other people have played it, but you might not know it. Have you ever wanted to pilot a Gundam? Yes. Yeah. Then you should play Virtual On, which was a huh. two-player, uh, like, 1v1 versus fighting game where you'd have two cabinets connected to each other, but you'd sit in a chair and you have two joysticks oh, yeah. with buttons on the top and, like, triggers and some other, like, levers and shit. And, and that would be how you would walk. So, like, to move oh forward, you press both levers forward to, like, you know, rotate to the left. It was one to the back, one forward, yeah. like, zero, you know, zero G lawn mowers. But then you also had fucking guns, missiles, and a lightsaber. And then you could, like, press both outwards and it would, like, jump up and jet pack up and shit. And then you could fly around a little bit till you ran out of jet fuel and you could, like, fly up and then slash down with the sword. Dude, this sounds a, fucking sick. It's a high fucking skill curve to learn how to do cool maneuvers, but it's yeah. fun as fuck. Dude. And Laser X had it, and for some reason, it was always on free play, so I would just sit there all fucking day and yeah. be like, who's up next? Who who wants to go? Fucking free Gundam game. Let's fucking fight. And I got super good at it. Dude, Laser, Laser X. X? like Laser X. And no underneath shit. Ball. Yeah. So rounding out my list... My Lincoln, uh-huh. a favorite. Your favorite. I can't believe no one has picked anything from the genre. I'm not taking Street Fighter. I'm taking oh, the yeah. slightly superior Marvel vs. Capcom. Yeah, I was just saying. We, I mean, we, someone's got to have at least one fighting. Yeah, which, which one specifically? The first one. Okay. I like the character setup for the first one, and I like how you can combo just about anybody. Like What's Mega the, Man's a is trash. The first character, one called Marvel vs. Capcom. Yeah. I thought the first one was called something else. You're probably thinking of that X-Men fighting game. On Dreamcast. Power, gem, gem, War, War of the Gems. Yeah, okay. that was an X-Men fighting game. Yeah. Anyway, it's it's Street Fighter, like, 3 or Ultra or whatever, but there's more. There's, like, tag team system, and you can hit, like, fucking assists and shit if you hit, like, two buttons. Spider-Man's there. 
It's hmm. really good. It's like the best Street Fighter system for fighting button controls that I've ever found. Okay. I like it the best. Okay. But Brad. Yeah. But but, but also Spider-Man. Spider-Man's there. Yeah. Spider-Man's really that, good. That too. sells the whole game. That's a, <laughs> he went on this long diatribe about the the mechanics, but like Spider-Man's there. Yeah. Like, that's all you need. <laughs> and if you go down, back, and then mid, middle kick, then then he jumps in the air and does his little swing. Oh, Whoosh. nice. It's it's a real good real good get up in your face move. Yeah, it's a good pick. It's a good yeah. pick. Yeah, Marvel's Capcom. All right, Jay, play it every time. My favorite arcade game. Favorite arcade game. It's a really tough choice. Cause like I love fighting games, but like none of them are really like. After I started working it up down there, it have become my least favorite game. Yeah, play more Marvel vs. Capcom. <laughs> mm. it's so good. And since pinball is off the list, you know what? I think I might go with my current favorite arcade game to play. And this one, bit of a wild card. Yeah, bit of a wild card. Oh, yeah, one. my current my the 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 arcade game I have had the most fun playing as of late, especially like on slow days when I'm like not when people aren't in there and I'm just working, but I'm just chilling. I'll throw away a token. I'll get three songs on DDR. Nice. Oh shit! A lot of oh my god, I forgot about DDR. That is kind of like a wild yeah, card. I've been playing a lot around. of DDR day. Yeah. Lately. That game's fun, and like the first time you do it, and you get kind of good, and you're like, I can improve my life playing this. Right? Like, yeah. This, this yeah. is as good as running. Like play it, yeah, and then I'll uh, gotta play it with a mask on to make it like more of a cardio workout. Yeah, yeah it's great. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, that was hovering around my list real. Currently, hard. my favorite song is "Speed Over Beethoven." Nah, I mean that one's good, but you gotta play "Drop the Bomb." Oh, that's a good one too. It's my favorite. I've been just kind of. I've been. I I've, I have a routine. I do the roulette. Okay. Just let it and just you know just do let it. it ride or or random. And then, or, and then I'll do, like, Speed Over Beethoven, and then, like, one of, like, something from, like, the tier I'm working on, what I'm working on, I'm trying to pick from, like, the second hard, like hard song. or whatever? Yeah, or whatever's before that, because there's, like, the blue ones, and then the, or the, the green ones, I'm yeah. working on the blue ones. Oh, okay. Like, where Butterfly is, that yeah, difficult yeah, yeah, yeah. range. But that's my favorite, like, area to play. Yeah, because it's and fun, and, and, but still kind of challenging. It's fast, but not hard. Yeah, I kind of want to go play some DDR tonight. But Drop the probably. bomb. All right, I get the last pick. You got the last pick, baby. All right, my favorite arcade cabinet here. I feel like there's no surprises coming coming here. Y'all know I get wet for jets. I fucking love Afterburner. <laughs> Afterburner is sick. Afterburner is so sick. Uh, and the is thing is, sick. honestly, I feel like it's really not that good of a game. No. I mean, it, it definitely has like a level that's just like you're done playing now. Yeah, it's it's, it's pretty early on. It's designed to take money. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's but a lot of I fun, mean, though. just piloting a jet, do, avoiding missiles, shooting people down—it's mm-hmm. a good time. I enjoy it a lot. Jets are sweet. And I, I, like them. I will gladly just replay those same three levels over and over and over again and you have know, a great time doing it. There's no good boat game. Oh, hydro duh. Thunder! Hydro you Thunder! Idiot. How did I not even think about Hydro yeah, shout Thunder? Shout out to Hydro Thunder! Oh my God! You put pick cruising over Hydro Thunder? Yes, Hydro absolutely. Thunder has fucking secret boats, secret pathways, secret fucking levels. Dude, yeah, Hydro Thunder. Hydro Thunder is fun. I I enjoy cruising more. Hydro Thunder. I just I I like that cruising has pedals and a shifter. Uh, what what uh other shooter were you talking about earlier now that we're done like oh time crisis okay yeah. that's what i was thinking oh too. yeah with yeah, shield button yeah, yeah, yeah. Kinda, i yeah, like that, the i yeah, like the pedal yeah um i also want to give a shout out to the lost world jurassic park the arcade game where you shoot poop well yeah where, where you're <laughs> i like a, i like a game where you like i like you go into something oh, being in the in the enclosure yeah in the enclosure thing is i don't know it just gives it another extra level of yeah. mystique and fun see i mean i, I think those good. those games are are fine but i feel like they're really short-lived and not worth how much they cost yeah uh that's those are like one to two dollars per play that's how i feel about like more modern arcade games like you're yeah. like you're like uh like the halo fire team raven yeah yeah like that game is just i mean it's also up to the place that it's in discretion obviously yeah. but like I, don't I feel know, like it's man. Those, those are like geared towards kids to be super simple for them to have like a very stimulating fun experience without and, actually really needing them to do anything. I mean, yeah. I like the the innovation we've gotten with these modern arcade games, like you like your Luigi's Mansion arcade. That's a lot of fun. Sure, but yeah, God, they're just so expensive to play. Yeah, yeah. I don't I don't want to pay two dollars for an arcade right. experience. I get like, it. I, I, like, I mean, I guess that's I understand. Why I love be- up down so much. Yeah. Everything's just one token. Yeah, that's how it should be. I guess that's also why I specified Cruisin' World over like the modern Cruisin' one. Yeah, Cruisin modern cruising Blast. is cool, but it's like yeah, cruising blast. Yeah. I'm like, 
I don't want to pay two dollars for like a very very short track. Well, that's how I feel about Mario Kart DX or whatever the yeah. racing Mario Kart yeah. game. Yeah, also great, but like, fuck, is it quick? I want three races. Yeah, yeah, like our DDR, you get one token, for, you get three songs. For yeah, one yeah, token. that's a good. That's yeah. really. I, worth I, your... I, I had, you have to, and I have to keep reminding people of that because I see people do mm-hmm. one song and then put in another, another token. token, and then like I'll see, and then they got like six credits in there. I'm like, hey, each token's three songs. Yeah, you got so many credits, guys. Yeah, pretty rad. But stay tuned. We're going to do a pinball one of these. Yeah. Which oh is going to get a lot more intense. Also, like, uh, we should do like an arcade game that's not cabinets. Like, like, like the basketball and shit. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like yeah, the yeah. free throw machines yeah, and air yeah. hockey. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Or yeah. amusement games. I yeah. Guess. yeah. Amusement you throw games. The, throw the ball at the and then, cats. And then we can do yeah. carnival games. We'll just do a whole month of games. <laughs> games. And then we'll... St- st- Top it off with games that made us cry. Oh, Jesus. Video games that made us cry. <laughs> All right. No, we won't. All right, take us home. Set. All right. Well, I hope you, uh, you, you, you people down there with your, why you got so much camping You're equipment. You're so small. You look like ants. You look like ants, but you got all this camping equipment like we're like some sort of deity. Are you like like don't don't worship us. We just we're just here trying to uh, No, they're do worshiping things. the arcade cabinets we just put on the monument. Yeah, we're just uh, trying to redo yeah. it. Well, I mean, we haven't even we're still trying to decide what we're going to put on and replace Mountain Rushmore with. <laughs> Every week we bring them this new idea, and they're just like, "No, we don't like that. <laughs> we don't like it." Why do they sound like that? Uh, the Nick Kroll. That's Nick yeah. Kroll. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Go home, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> then we're like, fine, we'll do it again next week. And then they're like, Ugh. so yeah, I guess we'll see you next week. We'll be up here. We're in Teddy Roosevelt's nose inside the mountain. 